Hey what's up guys today we'll be talking about cyber security only because in the past few months i have been seeing this upward hiring trend in cyber security it was not long ago that data science was considered to be one of the most sought after field however these days i'm seeing cyber security jobs are in more demand compared to data science and i don't think this has happened before so i thought it's worth sharing with those prospective future cyber security engineers and professionals I think one of the major reasons for this is this pandemic. Now it has been over a year since people are working from home. Earlier we thought that it would just be a matter of a couple of weeks or a, a, a month at the most and then people would be back in offices. However, that hasn't happened and as it has given a rise to chal cyber security challenges. Partly because nowadays people are using a lot of their personal equipments and their personal network compared to their corporate network which has opened the IT infrastructure of uh, Uh, corporates to cyber security threats now this is highlighted by the microsoft exchange vulnerability that was exploited earlier in 2021 by hackers i'm not sure if you're aware of this but thousands of microsoft clients were hacked hack uh, is not the word that i like to use but uh, uh, yes a uh, thousands but yes thousands of microsoft clients were affected by this vulnerability that was exploited by this hacking group based in china and uh, uh, i think it was found in exchange server 2013 and 16 and probably 19 i'm not really sure you can look that up uh, online but i just want to point out to the fact that uh, with the increase in remote working the number of opportunities for cyber criminals has gone up and hence the requirement for uh, professionals skilled in cyber security and information security now one thing i would like to point out that cyber security is considered to be a non transferable skill so if you have education in it if you know the tools that are used in the industry you are up to date with the knowledge then there are opportunities that employers are willing to provide especially in countries like ireland which is considered to be a technology hub uh, in europe now mostly from what i'm saying it's the uh, individuals who have experience and knowledge of uh, infrastructure security with skills in incident response and endpoint protection that are most in demand these days and obviously businesses are moving to cloud so those with cloud specific skills are also very much in demand roles like devops security penetration testers risk and control managers the key skills that i'm talking about here are information security cyber security network security change control security and cloud architecture security and if we talk about the education or certifications in demand those are cissp cism cisa what else is there iso 27001 um i think if you are from the same background cyber security background uh, you would have more knowledge than me uh, honestly even though i am from it i'm not from uh, the cyber security uh, background in my company we are using sophos enterprise which is an excellent tool and uh, it also prevents uh, ransomware and all these new attacks that are being taking place very recently we have also patched our exchange servers to mitigate that uh, exchange vulnerability that i was talking about earlier so all of these things were done by the infrastructure security team of my company Uh, it's just an example that i want to give you now talking about the salaries since cyber security is seeing huge amount of demand that means that people are drawing more salaries uh, in this field now if you are someone with an experience of 3 to 5 years minimum salary that you can expect in a country like ireland is 40000 and above which is a lot higher than the uh, average income of people so it's a very good field to pursue your career in provided that you have the expertise skills knowledge and of course your behavioral stress should also be good so that you get hired by companies in the first place now if you ask me i would have only one advice to people who are seeking a career in cyber security keep yourself up to date uh, you know in it it's not just for you guys but i would like to advise this for uh, everyone in the it field so be it tech support or devops or you know software developers cyber security so keep yourself up to date in this in these professions it takes only 6 months to forget things or you know become irrelevant so keep yourself up to date uh stay current stay current with what is happening around and uh, you know keep upskilling yourself uh, keep upskilling yourself through certifications or uh, you know doing projects on your own you can use online resources like github where you can go and find what are the trends and uh, what kind of projects are mentioned what are what kind of projects and case studies are mentioned on the website uh, it's pretty handy
anyway guys so this was just a short discussion about cyber security i hope you enjoyed this have a good day good luck bye bye